is Houston. Say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 34 of Dragon Age Inquisition on the Xbox Series X. The glorious 60 FPS boost mode on. And we're going to head straight off here. I've sold a few bits off, off camera. We're going to head straight off to Skyhold. And see if we can kick on this quest we were looking at in the last part. There's two quests that we need. We need to do something to get through this dust that's choking us. And they said someone at Skyhold should be able to help with it. A few things might kick off when we go back here, to be fair. Super quick loading times, please. We're going to get a cutscene going in. It's possible. Nope. Well, we need to do a bit of talking. I don't think it's going to point us to exactly where we need to go, so let's talk to folks. So, this is Skyhold. Come, let's walk the ramparts. I want to examine our fortifications. We'll be able to see Corypheus coming from miles away. We're safe for now. If we see him, he sees us. And we'll be ready for him. He's not going to get the better of us again. We lost good soldiers that day. Loyal men and women. Let him come. I swear I'll take the Twister Bastard down, even if I have to die to do it. Watch that this enthusiasm of yours doesn't get you killed. I wouldn't be the first to die in your service. The people flock to your banner, eager to fight for the Herald of Andraste. Their faith is a leash, and your Inquisition has taken hold of it. All right, Mr. Stroppy Pants. Tell me honestly, are you what they say you are? Andraste's chosen. I wish they'd understand that I'm really nobody. You're somebody. Don't you see what you are to them? Without you, they'd be consumed by despair. We all would. They need you to be Andraste's messenger. It gives them hope. The truth doesn't matter. Ah, uh, listen to me talk. Your time is valuable and I've wasted enough of it. Well, that's that conversation over then. Deliver the lure ingredients to Frederick. Yes, I know. We need to find some way of doing these other quests as well. We'll do Frederick when we get back. Oh yeah, I forgot you get XP for doing these little reads, don't you? Strangest thing. When I reached down, my dagger was gone. Just gone. Now where I found it? In a barrel. The thing was filled to the brim with daggers. Got the strangest feeling. I know someone took it right off my belt, but I can't recall who. Team meeting, is it? What's going on over here? Colin, what are you saying? Inquisitor, I've found where the Red Templars come from. They're in full redoubt. The knights were fed Red Lyrium until they turned into monsters. Samson took over after their corruption was complete. How do you know Samson? He was a Templar in Kirkwall until he was expelled from the Order. I knew he was an addict, but this... Red Lyrium is nothing like the Lyrium given by the Chantry. Its power comes with a terrible madness. I believe you that takes care of Samson. You're sure we, can, we can't use it? The Red Templar's swarming haven were proof enough. We cannot allow them to gain strength. 
The Red Templars still require Lyrian. If we find their source, we can weaken them and their leader. I like finding the Red Templar's vulnerabilities before fighting them head on. We'll need every advantage against what courses through their veins. Caravans of Red Lyrium are being smuggled along trade roads. Investigating them could lead to where it's being mined. If you confront them, be wary. Anything connected to Samson will be well guarded. As leader of the Inquisition, you... There's something I must tell you. Oh, I. <laughs> aye, aye, here it comes. <laughs> Spit it out, man. You can tell me anything. Whatever it is, I'm willing to listen. Right. Thank you. Lyrium grants Templars our abilities, but it controls us as well. Those cut off suffer. Some go mad, others die. We have secured a reliable source of Lyrium for the Templars here. But I no longer take it. You stopped? When I joined the Inquisition. It's been months now. You've never complained. Why would I? I chose this. After what happened in Kirkwall, I couldn't. I will not be bound to the Order or that life any longer. Whatever the suffering, I accept it. But I would not put the Inquisition at risk. I have asked Cassandra to watch me. If my ability to lead is compromised, I will be relieved from duty. Need to be going to Red Lydium Anonymous, I think. Uh, I've asked Cassandra to watch me. If my ability to lead is compromised, I will be relieved of my duty. All right, okay. Uh, are you okay? Are you in pain? I can endure it. Thank you for telling me. I respect what you're doing. Thank you, Inquisitor. The Inquisition's army must always take priority. Should anything happen, I will defer to Cassandra's judgment. Okie dokie. Let's have a look up here before we go anywhere else. I actually, <laughs> in coming back here to try and help with those quests, I, I, it was only when I started travelling I thought, oh, I, there's going to be a, a lot to do in here because we've not been back for a bloody ages. I think we opened the area and then didn't do much, if I remember rightly. Just a bedroom. Which way to go first? that view. Beautiful. Oh, come on now. Have you not fixed the wall yet? For goodness sake. Oh, can I go down there? Looks like it, isn't it? Probably get stuck now. <laughs> Where there's a will, there's a way. Oh, well, that was useful. Nothing here anyway. Bad house than rechts. We're after. It's 
set of steps there. There is somebody to talk to down there. Shops. Inquisitor. Oh, it's Blackwall again. I've been meaning to thank you. There are a hundred things that need your attention. You didn't have to take the time to help me. And yet you did. If the history you pursue benefits the Wardens, then it was worth it. You've proven yourself to be an honorable woman. Principled. I've great admiration for you. And I've never been more certain in my decision to join you. Oh, hello. Love interest. There will be opportunities for us to do even more in the future. Then I look forward to it. Varric's friend Hawk said there were suspicions of corruption in Grey Warden ranks. Do you know anything about that? Corruption? What sort of corruption? Corypheus. He's been known to influence the minds of Wardens. That could very well explain why so many have disappeared. If this is true, then all Wardens are in danger. Even you. We'd better find your brothers. I agree. If Hawk's given you an idea where to start, we should get moving immediately. Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. Is that it? Oh, hello. Inquisitor? Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. Our mounts have never had better. Nice. That's a statue. There was a real horse there for a second. Bonnie seems at your service. I trust good secret was not your course. Now that you've come to some good fortune, you deserve an upgrade. As master of the tradesman, I stand ready to supply your every need. Nice. Who or what are the tradesmen? A following of sympathetic and profit-minded individuals who promote local craftsmen and fair importers. A guild of sorts. Although that implies counter affiliations, we are not interested in crossing. Our purpose in the Inquisition is legitimate and honorable. You will have what you need at honest prices. Seems reasonable. What do you bring to the Inquisition? What you need, and more. It takes great coordination to make a remote location seem central. While there is no doubt the boutiques of Val Royale display the grandest of the grand, they do not travel. At least, not yet. Why are you a mere merchant if you're the master of this group? I wish to avoid the suggestion that I am a posturing commander atop a structure of malcontents. It is better to remain active, hands-on, do you not agree, Inquisitor? I... It's a shame Segret didn't survive Haven. It is, but one must continue. That's it? He was a shrewd man, but he was none too pleasant. It was time arrangements were made. I shall make every effort to prove that this is an upgrade. We'll speak another time. Of course. Well, that was a hoot. Ooh, blimey, she's got a few good ones, hasn't she? Got a good bow. And grips. Hmm. 
Bianca Arms 3, we could probably take. It's only 70. Bianca Grip. With the aiming module for that as well. Might be. Infused glass. Hmm, seem to remember something handy that can be used for. Blank runestone. I know I can. Oh, I can use those. I've got some runestone things for making some. Not recipes. What's the word I'm looking for? Schematics. Thank you. Bianca arms two schematic. Dragon slaying rune. <laughs> I feel like I want that. Grunsman bow for Sarah, but if I buy it, it'll tap me out of money. So level sixteen. As opposed to the 11 she's got on. It's unique as well. 114 damage. Oh, I've got 12 dexterity on the other one. That's what it is. Target explodes for 75% of weapon damage. Nice. Let's give that a whirl. I'm skint. Nice. Sweet ass bow like. Alright. Let's move swiftly on. Now that I've got no money left. Surgeon. Hmm. Somewhat off colour today, Inquisitor. An excess of bile, perhaps. Might I bleed you, or offer a herbal tonic? Uh, I don't think so, thank you. Right, well, we've spoken to everybody down there. Let's go up. We need someone to help us be able to breathe in the green mist, people. That's what we're after. <clears throat> what lurks in this place? Very good. How's your work? Prison structural evaluation. Harder job. This structural fractures throughout. Major block shifted. It settles over there. Oh, okay. I can't remember if that actually gets it, you know, built any better or not. Whether it's just one of those things. As I remember it, the construction keeps going until it's all really pretty. Your castle looks really pretty. Well, I think we should go up. Not so standard. That'll guide the dragon right in. By the time it's across. Yeah, because this is still getting constructed a bit in here. 
Captain Baddock, what are you saying, mate? Need something? I want to know more about Red Lyrian. I'll tell you what I can. I've seen it infect people like a disease and turn them to Lyrian. How can it do that? That's a good question. To tell the truth, we don't really know what that shit can do to a person. And I don't want to find out. I think that's enough on Red Lyrian. Yeah, not really my favorite subject. I'm trying to remember if we did we get to see the blacksmith before we went off? There's a blacksmith in bit in there, not in here. Solash should be in here somewhere, there he is. What can I do for you? We'll talk later. Goodbye. Dorian. The Inquisition supports free mages. What's next? Elves running Halamshiral? Cows milking farmers? I take it you don't agree. On the contrary, I approve. Heartily. I do wonder if you've considered what the support of yours will do. For mages in general, I mean. The Inquisition is seen as an authority. Given southern mages license to, well, be like mages back home. What would be wrong with that exactly? Nothing, at first. Thing is, the Imperium was once just like the south. Templars, proper circles, all that rot. Then it changed <clears throat> by inches. Not that this is reason to oppress us. Still. My homeland should be a cautionary tale, not a source of inspiration. Have you gone to see Alexius yet? He's in the cells. Not yet, no. I saw him before they locked him up. He looked... despondent. Broken. Not the man I remember, nor the one I want to. I realize it's now your job to judge him. All I ask is, if you do, show him mercy. He hardly deserves it, but for Felix's sake. I can't help hoping there's something left of the man I once knew. So I take it you're... Dalish? Is that the correct word here? Yes, that's right. We don't have Dalish clans coming northward, for obvious reasons. So I've never met one of your people before, although I've heard about them a little. I hope this won't be an issue between us. I am here to help you deal with the Venatori, after all. And I appreciate your help, Dorian. Excellent. Mutual appreciation is a grand way to begin. I should go. Naturally. Naturally. <sighs> Greetings again, Inquisitor. I trust everything is well with the mages. There have been a few scuffles with your Templars. But overall, it is going well. I'll leave you to it. As you were. Sure there's a table up here to put these things on. Research thingies. Ah, oh, this is uh, Vivian, I think. Right, hang on, I'll come to her in a sec. Where is me table? Like, there it is. Level up time. Fourteen. Does it do it in... Oh, hello. There we go. Bit of a delay on that one, though. <laughs> no creatures. All right, okay. I think we've done it. Greetings to you, Inquisitor. I am to serve as assistant to any research concerns. You'll find my skills are exceptional. I hope they prove useful. 
You're replaced. Uh, you replaced Minave. 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 Whatever name. Minave. Minave. We we'll call him Minave. I think. You're taking over the duties of Minave. Yes. Got it right. She said she was needed elsewhere, and that I should serve the Inquisition to the best of my ability. What is she doing? I wasn't told. How can you serve the Inquisition? I am to aid in the research of all creatures encountered in your efforts as leader of the Inquisition. What makes you particularly qualified? I remember being fond of animals. I don't remember why. <laughs> really? You were made tranquil. Yes, I am tranquil. It was necessary due to a willful nature that made wielding magic a dangerous endeavor. I remember that being a difficult time, but I cannot remember why. My skills are well used in my current position. What is your evaluation of how we're doing? Adequate. Based on a partial improvements to Skyhold. As you were. Yes. Increase. Carry on. One day I'm going to read all these books. One day, when I have time. <laughs> Very good. Right, well, I think... Oh, there's two more people. Or are they further down? Yeah, okay. Vivienne is the one we were going to go and see. If she's here. Yeah, there she is. Yes? I'd like to know more about you, Madame Vivienne. Whatever would you like to know? Never mind. Obviously done it already. There's another door down there. Which I'm not allowed to get to. Right, that main hall is somewhere we can go. Yeah, this is a bit of a quest, isn't it? Making decisions and stuffs. was a surprise. After you return from the bogs, we discovered this man attacking. The building. With a goat. <laughs> Chief Mavran the Under. He feels slighted by the killing of his Avar tribesmen, who repeatedly attacked you first. What should we do with him? Where should he go? You're a chieftain of the Avar. Will your attacks persist? <laughs> a courtroom? Unnecessary. You killed my idiot son. And I answered, as is my custom, by smacking your holdings with goat's blood. Don't look at me. No foul. You meant to murder Tevinters, but got feisty with your inquisition. A red-headed mother guarantees a brat. Do as you've earned, Inquisitor. My clan yields. My remaining boys have brains still in their heads. <laughs> Drive them out of my lands. Is it called a gibbet? Arm and exile him to Tevinta. Is it called a gibbet? Oh, I don't know. He could go in that... what's it called? A gibbet? Chief Movran, you'll be placed in a gibbet to serve as an example to... someone. Then probably released. Gibbet? <laughs> gibbet? Gibbet? <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, that wasn't my intention, actually. I didn't know what a bloody gib it was, which one clicks on it. It was just about everybody disapproved of my decision there. I was just going to let him go, but anyway. Undercroft, as opposed to the Lara Croft. Storage, finally. Uh, apart from... Ah, inventory, there we go. A unique dagger with 208 on it. Hmm. Clears up some space. I don't think any of that stuff doesn't count to my inventory, I don't think. Oh, it does. 21. Well, hang on, I need to find out what I'm doing with Bianca arms and stuff first before I go getting rid of that. Had it. Special shipments, eh? Well, that didn't give me anything. Serve the Lord, in yes. I'll yeah, be back later. we've been here before, I think. So, so, Bianca, wasn't it? Hala leather, plus eight dexterity. Five dexterity and three cunning. Where's are there? Modify. Bianca Arms three. What's it got at the minute then? Aiming module one, Bianca Arms three. Yeah, it has got Bianca Arms three already. Highly confused as to what's going on. So that's the boat. We'll pick out Bianca Arms 3 for that. Sturdy grip. Ah, here we go. Agile grip.
plus seven cunning. Plus five dexterity, plus three cunning. That's better. Onward. Well, we're none the wiser as to who we need to speak to to get uh, what we need for those quests. Oh yeah, the war room. And what else did Lady Forsythia say? That she'd rather drown herself than help the Inquisition. Anything else? She said she'd have us flogged alive if we allied with her brother. That does sound like her. Cheer up, Josie. We at least have her attention. You always do find the brighter side of things. We are in the midst of cementing an alliance with Lady Forsythia of Nevara, Your Worship. It's become a somewhat delicate task. Can I do anything to help negotiations? Uh, thank you, but I believe I have matters in hand. I dissuaded her from sending soldiers when she learned we'd struck an accord with a brother she's feuding with. Lady Forsythia simply employs a colorful manner of speech. I hope it doesn't wear on you. That's putting it mildly. Are you expecting her? Do you always apologize for bloodthirsty nobles? It's the usual showmanship expected from those in power, Inquisitor. Nothing more. But I confess I do miss my staff from the Embassy in Antiva. It was always useful to discuss the day's visitors with them. I have time if you'd like to review things with me. I wouldn't wish to impose. If it were imposing, I wouldn't have offered. Well, I admit, there are a few potential alliances it would be good to discuss. Right on the parlor floor. In front of everyone at the soiree. Who does such a thing in front of their guests? <laughs> the Duke of Kellington, apparently. And then there's calls lurking. It frightens our guests half to death. Lord Jinnar still won't respond to our letters. And Sarah, can she not find a single overshirt with that mustard taint on it? Then there's Dorian. The man refuses to take anything seriously unless it suits its whim. Not to mention... Oh, oh goodness. Have we been here an hour already? It went by so quickly I didn't even notice. You're far too polite. I didn't intend to go on for so long. You must think me quite the gossip. <laughs> You've been working continually since I met you, Josephine. And that can't stop. I must be going. But I leave feeling less troubled than I have in weeks. Right, she's a bag of no help as well then, looks like it. Oh, these are my quarters, I think. Oh, nice. New outfit, that'll do nicely. They have certainly spared no expense. Where in God's name am I, people? For goodness sake. Well, I don't know where else I can actually go to find help. <laughs> No idea who I'm meant to be speaking to about the... We've not spoken to Cole. Not found him yet.
could check out the war room actually. We could use. Oh, hello. See if we've got another combo here. Inquisitor, is it true? Is the mark on your hand magic cast by Corypheus? Corypheus claimed it's a spell gone wrong. I wanted to think it was a blessing. A sign the Maker was returning to his creation. How credulous of me. The Maker hasn't shown himself for some time. There's no reason he'd start now. Perhaps you're right. Does it hurt? The anchor, that is. It's not pain. It's more like my nerves go on fire. It sounds most unpleasant. A situation requires your attention, Inquisitor. Noble Chantry loyalists in the city of Jader are spreading accusations that you're responsible for the Divine's death. They're unusually organized. I recommend we send people to Jader to deal with the matter. Send some diplomats. We need some... Uh, we need some propaganda we need a show of force yeah. let's send some ambassadors to convince jada i'm not a monster in disguise excellent i believe there is much to be gained by winning them over it's good to see you what do the people make of us we've gathered many favors among the nobility they will be gently reminded of this any visiting dignitaries i should watch out for you may see the Countess Lutetia in the halls. A lovely woman, but her conversations tend towards the unusual. She's the patron of Orlais's greatest naturalists. The Countess's particular passion is collecting butterflies. That doesn't sound unusual. She goes into great detail about preserving them. It seems to involve large amounts of chemicals and pins. It's good to see you. What do the people make of us? We've gathered many favors among the nobility. They will be gently reminded of this. Let's speak later. Farewell. Yes? Let's speak later. Goodbye. Goodbye. Right, let's... Uh... Summon the War Council. Hey, cool, blimey. How are the rescue efforts? Have they found anyone alive? Excavation is slow, as you can imagine. We've got any points to be spending in here? Inquisition perk, one point. Oh, inventory capacity by 15. We've got those already. Adds one more potion slot for all party members. Well, well I did want that, didn't I? New dialogue options related to history. Plus 50% XP for each codex entry. Better prices with merchants. Uh, Inquisition procurers can leverage the organization's reputation to purchase a shipment of rare and value buy rights. Like a one off purchase, though, isn't it? Shrewdness get I can't speak. A little shrewd negotiation will allow Inquisition procurers shipment of high quality blah. Shipment of high quality blah. Yeah, it's all the same. Reduces by five percent the time it takes for Josephine to complete operations. Grants a ten percent chance to receive extra herbs. 
allows all rogues in the party to open masterwork locks. Might be worth it. Deft hands. Might get that, actually. Let's do it. I'll need larger coffers soon. You made the right decision. All right, okay. Hinterland resources available. The hinterlands is a notable res uh, source of elf root and onyx. Inquisition forces at camp should search for these resources and arrange shipment to Skyhold. A lot of mages just showed up. I hope they are friendlies because if they're not, we're in trouble. No idea what to say. Scholars have debated whether the Tudor's Legend axe was an axe set with crystal axe. Ooh. Possible the translation. No, just accept it. Locate the Tudor Bright Axe. Yeah, she's on it. Secure a route through the Frostbacks. We explored the Fallow Mire after you cleared the place out. I've stumbled on an old road that leads west of the Frostbacks. If it's cleaned up, you could use it to shave weeks off a journey through the mountains. I'd rather be wet than freezing. We could move. Yeah, what's the quickest one? Yeah, it's the army, isn't it? Inquisitor. Hmm. To Ambassador Josephine Montilliet. Thank you so much for the blah 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 blah. Earlier correspondence, I confess it's been the difficult it's been difficult to get those in Orlay to take this discovery seriously in the light of recent events. But I'm positive that scouting the Frostback Basin will yield historic discoveries beneficial to both the academic field and the Inquisition. As a staunch supporter, I am honoured to be working in such great company on this historic occasion. Investigate the Frostback Mountain, yeah. Feck's sake. <laughs> I had a feeling that was going to... Oh no, we're okay. We've scouted the region and set up camp. Professor Kenrick has the scouts gathering. Anything else they can't find so far? We've discovered a lot of very old buckles. Hopefully this yields something more exciting. Anyone who comes here should be ready for hostile wildlife and angry avar. This place is dangerous, Scout Harding. Would you like to gather your party? Not now. We have received a message from Ozamar, knowing an ancient darkspawn threatens Thedas. King Balan officially declared his support for the Inquisition. I would advise sending a delegation of to Ozamar as soon as possible to cement this alliance. At your service. Good, good. A specialised specialisations for the Inquisitor. Well, she's the only one left, so let's just do it. Let's see what we have. Right. Well, this has been a Skyhold episode, isn't it? Time are we on, people? 
We're around the 50 minute marker and we haven't found what we came here for. I assume that was new people arriving. Well, I have to say I'm extremely confused. I've got no idea. Well, we haven't spoken to old Iron Bull, whatever his name is. How do you know they won't attack here? Dark spawn don't think. They flow. They burst through stone, cut with their bloody hands, and they never stop. So we've not spoken to Iron Bull and we've not spoken to the young lad either whose name I keep forgetting. Or Cassandra for that matter. Stefan finally died. It was a blessing, really. He's been in so much. Hey. What's been going on? Ambassador Montelier sent me a basket of flowers to thank me for my work with the Inquisition. She's so lovely. Shouldn't you be out there, scouting? In a bit. We're in Skyhold for supplies and a change of personnel. Not me, though. Indispensable. <laughs> I have to go. Herald's Rest. A place for all in service here to rest, recoup, and persevere. The ways the heart remember best. Your saving grace, the Herald's Rest. Oh, that's lovely. A little poem there, isn't it? You got, a, you got a tune to go with that poem. Krem. Inquisitor. That's got a good ring to it. We're happy to be here, Your Worship. You need anything, let me know. Iron Bull said the charges were at my disposal. Do you have any suggestions on how to use them? I suspect Haven's quiet by now. Might be worth sending the boys back. We could recover some supplies, get an idea about the enemy's strength. We could even pick up any stragglers who haven't found Skyhold yet. Can we talk about the Bull's charges? Best company you'll find from here to the Anderfels. In my time with the Chief, we've gone up against everything from bandits to magic trees. We're expensive, but you'll never doubt we're worth it. I don't know anything in particular. Do the Chargers specialize in anything from a tactical standpoint? Bull doesn't want us large enough to work as an army. We're better as shock troops to skirmishers. We've got archers for hitting enemy infantry, Dalish with more archery, and Skinner and her people on the flanks. Rocky handles fortifications and traps, and Stitches keeps us all fighting. They mostly hold back. I'll lead the frontline fighters with Grimm, and the Chief goes wherever he can hit something. You said something about everything from bandits to magic trees. I'll admit to some curiosity. Right. Sylvans. That's what Dalish called them. Apparently spirits can possess trees, too. Some noble in the Dales, and they really don't like it when you call them Dalish nobles, had a haunted forest. His family had abandoned the land, but he wanted it back. The chief bought us all axes, and in we went. Between the axes and the torches, the Sylvans weren't too bad. Worst part was the squirrels. Are there rules for how mercenaries operate? If you don't want some noble to treat you like bandits, yes. There's also a code of conduct most companies hold to. Keeps things civilized on the battlefield. We accept surrenders for ransom from mercenaries, nobles, and soldiers wearing a lord's colors. Our prisoners are treated well, injuries tended. We'd want the same for any of ours who got captured. We'll talk later. Good chat there, fella. And you are? The bartender, Gavin. Just the bartender. You were expecting... Well, welcome to the Inquisition. Thank you. 
Welcome to the tavern. Where did you study? I assume you're trained. Bartending? I'm no alchemist. You mix the bottles that don't taste like nug and you pretend to listen. I suppose I trained at home during feast day family visits. My specialty is ale. Old Antiban recipe. The secret is ale. What's the word out there? Seven people want your minstrel dead. They'd settle for smashing her loot. They're afraid she'd sing about it. Is <laughs> that Sarah who's talking about? What's the current mood? Obsequious. As you were. Inquisitor. Right, uh, I think we'll have a look upstairs. I hope I can help somehow. Maybe cleaning? Oh, Inquisitor, I, um, I joined. Sutherland, your worship. I saw some bandits, so I came to warn people. I'll let your warriors know and then stay out of the way. I love this song about Sarah. This is where you need the dance button. <laughs> well, there you go. It's always nice to pause for a tune sometimes, people. I thought I'd feeling Sarah was up here. Ah, oh, she might be over here. Hey, you. I have an Inquisitor favour to ask. Just a little thing, really. A little march around for some of your people. It's nothing for you, right? All right, let's see what you've got. Jump right in, huh? I like that. It's a red Jenny thing. I got a tip that some noble stiffs are arguing over Vachelle. Landscape. They're getting little people beat up. So I need you to go to your big table and send some people to walk through town. Just walk through? Just walk through. Easy, right? Was this a tip from one of your friends? Not a Jenny. Just normal angry people getting sick of being in the middle. I don't usually hear about things this far away. But having a friend like you is like getting really big ears. Bigger than normal, I guess, because we both... Never mind. Because <laughs> we've both really got really big ears. All right, Sarah. I'll have someone look into it. It's fun, right? Being important without doing a thing. Well, not much of a thing. Not everything has to be torn skies and ancient assholes. Every little thing makes a difference somewhere. <laughs> ancient assholes. <laughs> Demon armies and wardens, and Varric has exactly who we need. The big talker just knows everything. Oh, what happened there? Oh, hello. I was thinking you and I should get to know each other. You've got a pretty way about you. We can see where that goes, if it goes the way I like. 
I mean, maybe. Yeah, maybe. And I am a good judge of people. I don't date pricks. Really, because prick and prick. Look, you're nice. Let's travel around more. I get to know you. We'll see. Something on? Already done that one. Tell me about yourself. Oh, yeah. Interested, are you? <laughs> Flirting how? How about the basics? Where are you from? Ferelden. I got that from the accent. Where in Ferelden? All over. Okay, fine. Denim room for a bit. South, north, wherever I want. There are no connections you want to mention at all. Nope. How very Kunari of you. What? Never mind. Good, right? You're skilled. Who taught you how to use a bow? No one. That seems unlikely. What? I picked it up here and there. Mostly it just makes sense. It's not like that for you. It never occurred to you that doing what you do should require some effort. Well, yeah. I practice. Some. Not like Cullen and his pets. I mean, you miss, then you don't. Is it that hard to see when it's wrong? Well, it's not like that for other elves, I know that. <laughs> Most I know couldn't find an arrow sitting on it. Right. Maybe I just make it look easy and shite company. Fact still is, no teacher. Where would I find one in alleyways, anyway? <laughs> I'm just interested in talking to an elf like me. Mm, don't think so. Why not? Well, maybe you're all right. But most elves are too... elfy. Like that Solus, right? Never be as good as we were. Well, who's we? I'm just fine. There's a lot of tradition there. Should it just be thrown away? Your great-grandfather's dead. Why aren't you dead? You're throwing away tradition. That makes sense to you. None of it does in the city. That's why I'm not like an elf. We'll talk later. If you say so. <laughs> if you say so. Right. Well, I think we're going to have to wrap it up, people. We'll get to the hour mark. And I still haven't found what I was looking for. I'm like bloody Bono. Oh. <laughs> okay, maybe we'll wrap it up. We'll go look for coal. What are you doing? Listening. Eyes rough, jangling armor hurts my ears, back aching, fingers too clumsy for knots. Wind cool like Aunt Eloise's pond, lips scalded as I sip, warmth blossoms, first kiss in the barn, what was his name? Tin jangle as the blood spills, Pierre's wrapped body on the wagon to the chantry, five more minutes, my fault. Can you listen to anyone's mind like you did hers? No, they have to need me. Pain, fear, sadness, guilt, anger, hurt. Things I can fix. Can you do something for her? Yes. It's okay. Nothing you did mattered. What? Who are you? They lie there, and sometimes they die, just like Pierre. You can't save them. I don't... I don't know who you are. Wait. That didn't work. Let me try again. You'll forget me in a minute. What are you going to do? Make her forget me. Then do it again, the right way. Cole, stop. Inquisitor, your worship, what are you doing here? Is this man with you? Yes, 
Sorry to trouble you. How do I do it right if I've done it wrong and I can't make her forget? Just talk to her. Apologize, it's not your fault, healer. Don't root around inside her head. Treat her like a normal person. Your worship, is that? Do you need something of me? You were sad. Of course I was sad. A man died because I couldn't save him. It wasn't your fault. You could work until you fell over and you still wouldn't save everyone. Thank you for saying that. Excuse me, Your Worship. She's not better. She needs time to work through it. If I'd done it right, it would have worked faster. Then you have time to work through it too. I don't understand, but thank you for trying to help. Another one ticked off the list. Right, well, we're going to have to wrap it up there, folks, because we've reached that hour mark that I like to keep things around. Otherwise, it takes about a million years to render a video. So I will, I think what I'll do is I will have a little Google of who we speak to to get through the green mist just to speed things along a little bit. It did say that somebody at Stormhold was able to help us with something to get through that green misty fog stuff. So there you are. I enjoyed that actually, even though it was a, a quieter episode, just going around doing all the little story bits. I do like doing that, with, especially with the Bioware games, because uh, I love all the story stuff they put in and the decision making and all that malarkey. So there you are. It has been an honour and privilege serving for you in Dragon Age Inquisition on the Xbox Series X once again. And I'll catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.